Hi, my name is Tyson Davis. I went to Bret Hart High School in Angels Camp, California, and I'm taking Advanced Diesel and Core Diesel here at WyoTech. And I'm going to give you guys a tour of the shop today. So every truck we run through and we do wheel ins, so we do uh, everything in a wheel in brakes, uh, bearings, wheel seals, everything you could imagine there. And then working our way up the truck, we do drive lines and transmissions, pull the transmission out, do all the clutches and everything like that. Um, and depending on the truck and what's wrong with it, um, you, we may re be rebuilding a motor or whatever that may be. And we'll kind of walk through the shop here. Uh, this truck didn't really have anything too bad with it. We just did brakes and some uh, air springs and stuff like that. So every single one of these trucks gets brakes and wheel seals done to it on all uh, on all of the wheel ends um, and then any other broken parts or anything like that. We do a whole uh, PDI about it, pre-delivery inspection form. Um, so we run through everything on the truck. Anything that DOT would go over, we would go over. So as we go through um, on this truck here, we pulled the motor out, completely rebuilt the motor all the way from a bare block back into a running condition. And I can show you guys that. So this was one of three uh, rebuilt motors we did this, this, uh, this phase. Pulled the whole motor out, pulled the transmission out, rebuilt it, everything, and put it back together into running condition. Along with a white truck on the other side of the shop. Um, and I can show you guys that one really quick. So here on this truck, the motor was pulled out with the old motor that is right over here on that pallet. with a new motor that was put in it um, by a couple of the students here. That was the second motor swap this phase. And then on the other side of the shop, we did one more motor swap. So here on this truck, we did a complete motor swap out of the frame, pulled the motor out, pulled the transmission out, everything like that. It spun the rod bearing in bearing number three. And then now we're buttoning everything back up, doing our AC, um, all of all that kind of stuff, adjusting the brakes. And um, over here, they're doing uh, power steering tests. Should be. So these gentlemen are doing a PDI form before we deliver it to the customer, uh, which is just an extensive form that you would just fill out before you, we give the truck back after we've worked on it. Um, this truck right here just got back in from a regen the exhaust region um, and if you work your way this way this truck is ready to be delivered back to the customer um, we just did the PDI on this one as well um, and just finished all of our comps on this truck over here on this white freight liner um, we did uh, brakes wheel seals all the wheel ends and it is being picked up on Wednesday. And then in the back here, on this white freight liner in the back. So on this white freight liner here, we did a full cab swap. Um, it was uh, involved in a crash or rollover. So we pulled the cab off and we bought a new cab and replaced the cab with a, a used one, but one that wasn't rolled, obviously. And so all the electrical, all the, everything is all redone and new harnesses, new airlines, everything like that.